Good morning, and thank you for starting your Monday with Denver 7 News. I'm Nicole Brady. And I'm Eric Lufer. Let's get right to our top stories. The city of Aurora is expected to take another step today in making sure its police are held accountable. Last week, the department announced it was changing some of its policies, including banning the carotid hold. Today, the Aurora City Council expected to hold a special meeting to formally appoint 13 members to a new task force that will review city policies and make recommendations to council, possibly opening the door for independent review of police in the city. Boulder is lowering the speed limit. The city's new slogan is 20 is plenty. Starting Thursday, all residential and local speed limits will be lowered to 20 miles an hour. Residential roads make up 70% of Boulder streets. The goal is to keep walkers and bikers safer. The city says the pandemic has shown the importance of sharing the road. Today is expected to be the last day of the legislative session. The session technically was supposed to end Friday, but it was extended. On the docket for today, a bill on housing assistance for people affected by coronavirus, a new tax on tobacco and nicotine products, and a bill that would allocate revenue to the state education fund. Fire in southwestern Colorado has burned nearly 900 acres. These are photos of the East Canyon fire burning near Durango. It's forced officials to issue mandatory evacuation orders for two neighborhoods on the Montezuma and La Plata County line. Right now, the cause of the fire remains unknown. Lisa joins us now with your first alert forecast. It's going to be a warm one. Fire danger obviously has been really high with as warm and as dry as it's been extremely mild this morning. We're right now in the low to mid 60s winds out of the southwest at about 5 to 15 miles per hour, and it's going to be a really hot start to our week. Take a look at the warm up. We should be by about 10 o'clock in the mid to upper 70s, 85 by noon, and that's going to be another good 7 to 10 degrees on top of that for high. So Denver right around 94, Platteville 95, 70s and 80s for the mountains. It is going to be quite a bit hazy today, so do look for that. We'll see a hazy sunshine this morning. Pretty clear skies, though, right now statewide. We'll take a closer look at when we're going to see some thunderstorms later this week, more so tomorrow and Wednesday.